Hey, Uncle Mud here. You're looking at the wall of the straw bale sauna at Deanne Bednar's place, um, where the day previously I had sprayed a single coat of uh, terra coat uh, uh, on the side and um, let it dry. Now today I'm spraying the wall with a um, hose, uh, which is generally something you don't do to a mud wall because uh, like it's doing uh, outside of the, the light spot there, uh, a, um, a spraying the wall with the hose will basically erode the mud wall away very quickly. Um, but as you can see where I have been spraying the wall with the uh, within that light spot, um, nothing is uh, washing off with the water. The water is just beating up and rolling off. The uh, coating uh, is breathable, so it's not uh, causing uh, moisture to damage it from the other side. Uh, and even in spots where this rough um, plaster uh, is extremely um, uh, porous, uh, it has soaked in the uh, terracote and given us a, uh, a water-resistant finish. Um, I wasn't able to erode this uh, finish away. Uh, the water ran clear as it came down uh, the side of the uh, um, of the, the wall. Uh, very impressive, uh, and we're uh, looking forward to uh, uh, doing more tests like this in the future. notice the places where I just sprayed a little bit of the terror coat um, those places uh, stayed um, dry uh, where the terror coat even had a little bit of a covering um, and uh, where it didn't um, I got the uh, uh, earthen plaster turning back into mud very quickly and uh, eroding off of the wall. Um, look forward to doing more with this.